channel. So I know that I've been gone for a hot minute, but that's because I've been moving. I don't know if you can tell that this is a different background. Me and my husband moved out to a new two bedroom apartment. So this is my filming room, which is pretty exciting. Before I was filming in our bedroom and it was kind of crowded in there and a little bit uncomfortable. So this is so great. I get my own space and my own area to do what I want to do with it. Yeah, I'm really sorry for my absence, but hopefully I can make up for it in the next weeks to come. It's still pretty hectic around here trying to get used to running a full household by myself. Back to the point of this video. Today's video is going to be a makeup tutorial. It's kind of a simple eye with a winged liner, but you can kind of pair it with any kind of lip combo that you want and it would still look great. I decided to keep the red lip for the intro because I really like it and this is a matte red lip which I've been feeling at the moment. So I do show you different kinds of options in the video just so you can choose whichever one you like most. But this is just what I preferred. When I paired it with the red lip it really did look like a classic glamorous look like old Hollywood kind of thing and so I threw on these earrings that kind of went with it. But this look can really be anything. It's super cool because this simple eye can turn into something a lot more glamorous depending on what kind of lip you pair it with. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye! So since my face is already done, I'm going to apply some Vaseline to moisturize my lips and make sure my lips don't look chapped when I put my lipsticks on them. And for my eyes, I'm going to use my Naked 2 palette and I'm going to use the color Tease and a big fluffy blending brush. This is an E40 from Sigma to apply this color all over my crease. This is just going to give my eyes some definition. Then I'm going to take the color Foxy, which is a matte kind of bone color eyeshadow and I'm going to apply that all over my lid. This is just going to brighten up my eye and give some contrast with that Tease color. Now I'm going to take my Jaclyn Hill, Jaclyn Hill favorites palette from Morphe and this kind of burgundy deep plum shade was well, not really plum it's just like a purplish brown I'd say and I'm gonna I use an E25 blending brush to concentrate this in the outer corners of my eye and my crease out there in that corner right here I'm just applying some more epoxy to just brighten up my eyelid and I'm using the E40 again with some of that tease color to just blend any harsh lines that may have created. Now I'm going to use the color Booty Call which is a kind of sparkly color and I'm going to apply this in the inner corners of my eye. This is going to brighten up my eyes and open them up a little bit more. And then I'm going to take that same color and I'm going to apply it underneath my brows right there in my brow bone and then I'm going to take the E40 and blend between my highlight and my crease color to make sure there's no harsh lines. Then I'm going to take this a small brush, I can't remember the name, I'm sorry, but I'm going to use that to apply the tease color right there in my lower lash line, my outer lower lash line. And then I'm going to take the E25 brush and a little bit of that uh, purplish brownish color from the Jaclyn Hill palette and I'm going to kind of blend that color out so it doesn't look so harsh and right here I'm just applying some of that uh, sparkly color in the inner corners of my eyes so I'm just going to create a winged liner for this because I feel like it goes super well with fun lips or bright lips I do have a full video showing you how I do my winked liner so I will create a link right here so you guys can check that out if you'd like I just thought I would show you how I did it pretty quickly right here so you have an idea how this eye look looks with that so once that is done I'm going to curl my lashes and I know this curler is so beat up but it's my favorite so that's what I use now I'm just applying some mascara to my top and bottom lashes and I do several coats. This is my Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara, which is my favorite. And right here I'm using my Rimmel Lash Accelerator. So the first lip color that we're gonna do is kind of like this Kylie Jenner inspired look. This is Milani um, Spice Lip Liner and Maybelline's Touch of Spice Lipstick. I love these two together and this gives me like a 90s vibe, which I love. And this is totally something that Kylie Jenner does wear. 
So the next look is this Revlon Unapologetic Color. This is actually one of those uh, lip butters or lip balms that they carry. But this is a matte color and it's really, really pigmented and I love it. So this is really summer appropriate and it's such a fun color to wear. Now I'm gonna use this Maybelline Coral Crush Lipstick. And over top of that, I'm going to apply Revlon's Coral Reef Lip Gloss. Now this is the only shiny lip that you're gonna see in this video because I am totally in love with matte lips at the moment, but this is so summery. I really love this color, it's so girly. The next color is my favorite at the moment. This is NYX Fuchsia Lip Liner, and over top of that, I apply NYX Shocking Pink Lipstick. I swear, it, it on camera, it looks kind of purplish, but this is totally pink, and it's such a dupe for Candy Yum Yum by MAC. I love this lip color. I get so many compliments when I wear it, and it's matte, which is what I'm obsessed with right now. The last lip color I'm gonna show you is a classic red lip which I feel that like goes super well with the eyeliner and look that I did. This is NYX Hot Red Lip Liner and NYX Eden Lipstick. This color is so pretty and I feel like this shade of red makes your uh, teeth look whiter. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and see you in the next one. Bye!